I'm Telfar Clements from New York City. I started making clothes when I was probably like 15. I can't wait to change the world. <laughs> Innovator, icon, and the it designer. We heard it all last year in 2020. Telfar Clemens is the one to watch. With the mission to redefine gender norms in high fashion, his eponymous global brand Telfar is committed to and perfectly reflects the founder with its centric theme of accessibility, queerness, and black pride. Their motto, it's not for you, it's for everyone, derives from the notion that luxury can and should be inclusive, regardless of gender, race, class, or sexual identity. So it's our duty to honor Telfar Clemens or Revolt's Black History Month makers. Brought to you by Levi's. As a queer Liberian, Queens native, and trailblazer, Telfar Clemens is changing the face of fashion for all marginalized people. Going on 16 years in the game, Clemens has stayed true to his commitment to community. In 2017, this was explicitly shown in a collaboration with White Castle. Clemens not only designed 12,000 employee uniforms, but the following month, he released an exclusive collection with the franchise, having proceeds go towards bailing out minors at Rikers Island. That same year, he became the first solo black male designer to win the CFDA Vogue Fashion Fund. Thank you so much for this incredible honor. Clemens invested the $400,000 prize money into the Telfar shopping bag, known as 2020's It Bag, or the Bushwick Birkin. The Telfar shopping bag is revolutionary and has become the staple in every closet. Oh my God. Last year, the demand increased with every restock selling out in a matter of seconds, not minutes, seconds. This led to the Telfar bag security program. The program gave consumers 24 hours to purchase as many bags as they desired, with the understanding that they would receive it months later. Now all you gotta do is go out and get you a bag. It's up now, <laughs> you you buy it. it now. It will sell out. <laughs> Another pivotal moment in Clement's career was back in 2019, when he attended the prestigious Met Gala and designed the ensemble for Moonlight star Ashton Sanders. Soon after, he would be named CFDA's Accessory Designer of 2020. And to top it all off, Oprah listed the Telfar shopping bag on her favorite things list, mentioning how she takes it everywhere. Hello, hello. Since then, Telfar has joined forces with UGG and Converse for two separate collaborations dropping in 2021. He can't and won't be stopped. Historically, we've seen high fashion brands with creators who do not reflect their consumer and prefer being inaccessible. Clemens is making black history by not only mirroring his audience, but by sticking to his principle that good quality and opulence should be available for everyone. As the industry is collapsing, I feel like our brand is rising because you know, of what we stand for and who we are. That is why Telfar not only rose amid a recession and global pandemic, but remains sold out. He taps into the infinite power of the consumer by displaying his supporters all over Telfar social media, making their audience feel seen through a mutual exchange of support. The brand posts their consumers alongside A-list celebrities like Solange, Dua Lipa, Bella Hadid, and even AOC, who all now have something in common, Telfar. Telfar Clemens is one of few designers that doesn't compromise on putting blackness and queerness at the forefront. He is for black people. He is for queer people. And that is why he, along with his brand, is for the extraordinary.